No. Uh, experience doesn't matter. Playing well matters. And the team that wins is not going to be the most experienced team. It's going to be the team that plays the best. So we got to prepare the best. We got to execute the best. Um, we got to perform the best under pressure. And if we do that, we'll be champions. And if we don't, we won't be. You know, I had an incredible 20 years, you know, really this incredible 20 years. And I wouldn't change anything over the course of 20 years that were magical and all the relationships, again, that I developed. And, um, you know, those shaped me into who I am as a person, as a player. Uh, my kids were born in Boston. Um, you know, I have great affection for the city, the everything that uh, Boston has meant to me and my family and all of New England, not just Boston. I didn't even know where New England was when I got picked by New England. That was always a funny story. They called me and they said, oh, you've been picked by New England. And I was like, that's amazing. I, where's New England? No, we ramp it up this week because there's so many uh, obligations with the media next week. Uh, you don't want to try to teach your game plan and uh, we'll ramp it up again next week, but we're getting everything taught. Uh, had a great practice today and we'll, we'll go full speed Friday and Saturday and uh, then come back and, and get a, get a full week's work in. But again, while the obligations to the media and everything else, it's different next week. Uh, the women uh, was by choice. I thought that door needed to be open. They're great teachers. They worked their tails off and, and they're more than qualified. Um, really happy to see Sarah calling the ball game, getting to be the first official. Uh, but a inclusivity and uh, diversity are great ways to teach. I mean, the more input from different types of voices, the better output you get. And uh, so, yeah, we're very, very proud of our staff and, um, and uh, looking forward to uh, having a great game.